Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that during the recent season, Mike and Sam hit a combined total of 54 home runs. Mike hit 8 more home runs than Sam. How many home runs did each player hit? Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now we are given that Mike and Sam hit a combined total of 54 home runs. Mike hit 8 more home runs than Sam. And we have to find the number of home runs hit by each player. Now let us use a Dravid model. First we have to relate all the parts of the given problem. Now here, total home runs equals home runs hit by Mike plus home runs hit by Sam. So we have related all the parts of the given problem. Now we will find what is given to us? Now here, unknown is the number of home runs hit by each player. And here we are given that Mike hit 8 more home runs than Sam. So let number of home runs hit by Sam is equal to x thus number of home runs hit by Mike is equal to x plus 8 therefore Total home runs, that is 54, equals home runs hit by Mike, that is x plus 8, plus home runs hit by Sam, that is x. Now next we will write the variable and substitute values. Now here we have 54 is equal to x plus 8 the whole plus x. Now let us solve this equation. Now 54 is equal to x plus 8 plus x. Now this implies 54 is equal to, now combining like terms on the right hand side, we have x plus x, that is 2x plus 8. Now we subtract 8 from both sides of this equation. So we have 54 minus 8 is equal to 2x plus 8 minus 8. This implies, now 54 minus 8 is 46 is equal to 2x. Now we divide both sides of this equation by 2. So it will be 46 upon 2 is equal to 2x upon 2. And this implies now 2 into 23 is 46. And 2 into 1 is 2. So this implies 23 is equal to x. Thus, x is equal to 23. So, number of home runs hit by Sam is equal to x, that is 23. And 
number of home runs hit by Mike is equal to x plus 8 this is equal to 23 plus 8 and this is equal to 31 so number of home runs hit by Sam is equal to 23 and number of home runs hit by Mike is equal to 31 and this is the solution of the given question that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.